This pandemic has brought everybody to the same level. Rich, poor, educated, uneducated, all of them crying out for the one little thing that we take for granted. Oxygen, air. Breathing seems like a basic human right, but when you have COVID, it's not. First, it was my mom who got infected. And when I was there, still nursing my mom, I got a phone call that my daughter Valerie is sick. My husband, he was also very sick. They are both just saying, we can't breathe, we can't breathe. I'm in Zimbabwe, we needed an ICU bed, we needed oxygen, and there was nothing. Good afternoon, Zimbabwe. Today has been a very difficult day. It feels like a bloodbath. Literally since morning, there's been death upon death. Patients who are losing have not been vaccinated. They can't breathe, and they come to us very desperate. When my family was almost dying, there was not one single vaccine. Since the pandemic started, We've lost a quarter of these patients, and this is the only hospital providing critical care support in northern Uganda. We have the poorest vaccination status of the whole world. Rich countries talking about going back to business is normal, and WHO has challenged them to stop this vaccine apathy. It's so important that we vaccinate the whole world. I will continue to fight for access to vaccines until my own last breath.